Today, we're playing Annie and Jin. This is kind of like the usual aggro deck, but we're using the Ravenborn Tome and Headmaster Stealthy to make plays like this. Nice, that's a nice amount. You feel the stack for yourself too? <laughs> this is already 12 damage, by the way. They can't play right, that's all that matters. It's a kind of weird combo deck that just plays very aggressively in the early game and then sometimes just fills the entire stack to stop the opponent from interacting with you. It's fast, fun, and wins a surprising amount of games. So don't forget to do a pirouette on the like and subscribe button and happy high rolling. I mean, we never whiff with this deck. We always draw something playable. No, that's not playable, actually. Weird. Okay. Here we go. There we go. Playable. Let's go make some friends, Tippers. There's no way they take a weapon. Okay, I want to see if they take the weapon removal. What a bastard Damn move, man. Me. Whatever. Taking it. How are you feeling today? I'm thinking it might be tomorrow. I think uh, tomorrow I'm gonna play Rundera for like an hour and then we'll do uh, a bit longer fiddle. I'm kinda, I'm, I'm prepping for uh, when, when I leave for, uh, for the weekend. So I wanna make sure that the Yuka content is still up daily. So I think tomorrow will just be the fiddle day. Okay, I, they didn't take weapon removal, clearly. Alright, let's see. This will be good. What you gonna do? I oh, speaks okay. Um, no, nah, I don't want to attack with Delcy. I'm going for the high roll, dude. Get it. <laughs> Mine is nice. And there's more. There's so much more where that came from. What rank are you in league? Uh, I used to be master like three years ago, and then I quit playing because Room Terror came out. So uh, I'm running a series on YouTube right now called Fiddle Six to Master. It was me pack picking the game back up, basically. We follow the legends until we become them. Wait, this deck is not cringe. It's actually cool. Semi base deck. Before us. Okay. They have eight mana. They can't play berries. They can't play the big recall card that got buffed. I'm. I think I'm doing it. I think I'm doing it I, I, for the cool. I'm doing it. All right. Somebody said do it. I'll do it. For content. Hey, but guess what? It doesn't even matter. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> Act with conviction. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> oh my god. Just instantly filled a stack with nine of them, dude. <laughs> I don't even know when I muted myself, but um, I said no to Desert Naturalist. I don't think we should need that. Now I have like uh, I have my stream deck like right, like right next to me, and it's like it's right next to my mouse. And I, I feel like sometimes maybe I like slightly tap on, the Tiffers. mute button. It's playtime. And it's a bit sensitive. I I don't know. Either that or I'm just losing it. I need just a moment. Like Improve stream button? I, I I have that too, yeah. I always activate it at the start of stream. Car 
It's Mr. Kai Thero! Kai. It's Kai Thera, Annie. Hey, Tibbers. Hey, son, a new player. Should I craft non Darius deck? Afraid it's gonna get needed? Uh, I'm assuming you, you like mean spiders? nerf next patch? Let's really let decide against crafting any Janna deck. I mean, okay, so the thing is, it's pretty budget. If you're a new player, you should already have, like, a lot of the cards that you need. So, I think it's worth to craft it, because it's it's relatively cheap. But yeah, there is always a chance that it gets nerfed, and next season we go into the Eternal season. You can still play standard. Line up. Uh, but yeah. Explosives prime. If you had to take my word for it, oh, I would say craft it. But way. if you didn't, I, I could see it, you know? Boom. Yeah, even if it's nerfed, it will still be. It's it's, it's, one of, it's like a classic. It's uh, you can't really go wrong with it. First the smoke, then the fire, then the chimney. They wanna play in the We're getting news on Risk of Rain returns on the 25th, but oh, it's in two days. Sick. I know a challenge when I see one. Yeah, I think opponent realizes that if quick. if this is what they have Let's to do, they're probably dead. Got. Yeah, you definitely blocked Annie. Okay, 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 okay. They, they live, they live, but that's alright. Right. Because here's the thing, right? They kind of need to kill the Annie. And if they do, we play Jin and we put the weapon on Jin. Actually, we, we need to not lose to Wadi Business. The boy band song comes out in like six minutes. Alright, we're, we're gonna have to watch that one, I guess. For glory, face me! I don't know. <laughs> that might be yeah, that might be copyright strikeable. The stage is set. They'll never see it coming. At most they can remove one of our units. Delcy is better. Yeah, no, I mean. Ace Nui, hope you're having a great, you know, when it start the teaser of the new expansion. Five weeks? Five and a half weeks? Oh, okay. Oh, they're dead. Right. Yeah, that, that added uh, like 15 damage. Right. There is art here waiting. All right. It's pretty good. <laughs> Again, it's eight. It's not nine. It's eight on the stack. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, Telsey book is kind of nuts, man. <laughs> yeah, GG. GG. And that's, that's, that seems like it's a pretty good matchup because they're so low in interaction. You just get to play the book wherever the hell you want. Like, Annie just takes over and then you put the book audience. on, like, something else. But I don't think that works. I don't think Fastaya can deny on full stack because Fastaya still needs to put something on the stack. You could play the burst spell. But it would be it would be number ten, right? Uh, okay, I like this, but I really want Jin. Yeah, for size of skill, it puts something on the stack to counter the rest. Yeah, I like the Sunhawk here. It's pretty good against overall. Come on, Dippers. it's playtime. Three mana do nothing. I mean. If we fill the stack, I think we win either way. Oh, yeah. It probably doesn't really matter. Vostaya can't even deny Aiden on stack. Is that is that actually the interaction? I don't know. Yeah, because the burst transform takes the ninth. I could believe that. Yeah, you, you, the burst puts uh, the ninth one on the stack, but then can't because it's full. I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. In position. Boom. The Winter's Claw strikes! Okay, so it could be... Sky Splitter. Donnie! Wanna play with Tippers? Okay! That sounds like fun! Oh, it's not. oh I wanna play! And that was like... Burning! Do we ever out-damage them? A fight! That's that's fantastic for us, by the way. If this is the blog, that's absolutely amazing. 
they're taking it. Okay. So let's see, they developed Xurn. We could play the Sunhawk. Will you try and build a Wild Tribe Princess in the I tried that a couple of times in the past. I never uploaded it to YouTube, but yeah, no, I will. Tell C2. Oh my god. Wait. Okay, if we take a beating here, can we ever win with the Prefect? I mean, I kind of want to play this, though. I think we have to. The the Prefect would have been pretty great, but I know they run... Uh, um, I know they run freezes. So I think the Prefect is a little easier to counter. Your aura is so blue. It's probably Sky Splitter. This kills them, right? They take nine, and then we have Lethal with the Is rolling even good there? Yeah, it's very good. Okay, right, so this is uh, four. They block, and then we should have Lethal with the Fervor. This one stuns, so they can't effectively uh, defend, defend against him. Like it doesn't even if they had like a 20-20 block in this, the first one gets stunned, and then it's still always nine damage to their face. They, they would need a stun or another whirling. The fact they used whirling last turn was actually a fat throw. Uh they kind of lost because they used whirling there. If they just used it on the Annie, I think the skills fizzle, right? Because Annie dies. Now we always have lethal with the fervor. I could just chill. Like I could play Mana Soul into Dusk Beaker to win. Tusk speaker. Blind for Nopsis. My axe is ready. GG. The anti takeover, dude. The anti takeover. My god. One tome to win the game. It'd be even better with Jin. If we had Jin in hand, I think we didn't even have to use the fervor there and they would have just died. But I'll take it anyway. Look at it. I met on the ladder at the start of the expansion. I added him and said, It's been a while. Where have you been? He replied, Here, Giga Chad. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Aragorn is a true Giga Chad, dude. We have Jin. Uh, okay. Oh, Annie, too. Annie is better than Saboteur, right? Because they can't remove Annie on one. Which deck got you to master the season? I got it in like the second week or something with Neela Janna. I played a pretty, uh, at the time it felt like it was a good version. Uh, I played Mirai and Tyla Invocation to counter some of the other stuff. Like I tried to counter Lurk, which was played a lot. Pretty solid. I'll need to interview him again to see how he's feeling going through. Oh, that would be fantastic, yeah. May Janna's will be done through me. No one's the wiser. You need humbling. I'm gonna need to uh, play the Sunhawk. I think Sunhawk is like super low value in this matchup anyway. Unless it's against Cat. So, that's fine. Would you rather make Aurelia, Ezreal, or Seraphine Prismatic if the game forced you to? Oh my god. What a question, dude. Those are all absolute demons. So, okay. Probably Seraphine. Uh, because while I hate the Seraphine meta, um, I think you can still build like semi interesting Seraphine decks. Everything's in play behind you. It's like, it, it, oh, like you can't really make an interesting Ezreal or Aurelia deck. Because they always come down to the same thing the same thing that broke the game. Ezreal is always burst killing, Aurelia is always blade dancing, and just like the. Not giving opponent a chance to block, but with Seraphine, if you build like something slightly different, it'll still be a pretty cool concept, I think. Fix my stage first or my lyrics. So much to do. And yes, we get some fiddle games before the stream ends. Um, 
Yeah, I'll, I'll... I could do that, maybe. I'll see. I want to level to Annie before the attack. I'm going to try, don't worry, going big this year. Yeah, if you need help, let me know, dude. It seems worth it. It seems worth it. They only have one mana. It's been four ads, all of them, for the same Mickey Mouse guy. Did, <laughs> did you cop it? Did you at least get it? This is interesting, right? I think there were two different plays we could have gone for there. One was the way the one we just did, and the other one was doing it on Annie to kill our Annie, but level her while it's on the stack, and then play this Annie. Well, we killed our board with uh, Paper's next turn. This is going surprisingly well. It's Integrator? No, I have Tabers. I don't really have to. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Woo! All right. <laughs> Sky Splitter incoming. <laughs> Every time, right? Every single time. Could it, oh no, wait, no, they generated this one. Never mind. Alright, well, if, if that's what they're doing, uh, I'm gonna start by playing. A, actually, is he level? And then we'll play Jin and put the weapon on Jin. <laughs> I played the wrong Jin. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I played the wrong Jin. Whatever, man. Doesn't matter. All right. It matters. Uh, not, not, not when we attack, dude. Here, watch this. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Okay. Oh, oh, I want to play. I have... Are you ready, Tippers? Pew pew. Okay, this levels Jin. And then before I continue, we put the deal four on the stack, transcend. and it's just game over. Game over. The Seraphine is down. Deal four twice. <laughs> Right? Surely they're dead. Surely. Oh, you sound great. Why are you still playing? You're dead. There's no way this spell, whatever it is, wins you the game. There's no way. Right? Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. GG. Seraphine down. There you go. And with that perfection. Yeah, you can go super fast. With, with deep some fans, depending on what card you play, right? Because a card like Soul Cleave actually makes you go so fast, too. This is that not many people run it. Oh, that's that's a hand right here, dude. Okay, if we find the weapon, we're good. Okay, we just need the weapon. Find weapon, win game. Or Telsey, even. I would settle for Telsey. Heavy metal is pretty common. Ah, probably not the ones I've played again. I mean, I actually think that heavy metal, yeah, it, it's probably just like an extremely good card right now, I guess. With uh, with how good Frailure it is. I feel like I say that often. With how good Frailure it is. Hi, hi, are you new too? I'm Annie. You're something special, aren't you, Annie? Aren't you? Okay, so if they put Yumi here, that's pretty bad. I don't know why the hell this deck runs Yumi in the first place, but uh, yeah. Phone's called Darius Prime and isn't playing Darius Nar. Huh. Where'd we end up this time, Book? On the elusive, huh? So we're gonna have to play Jin here because they probably lack removal, and then we can start stunning them. Maybe. I already made something. Bye. 
That's actually pretty good, because we might be able to kill that. Okay, wh why why are they open attack in here? I'm confused. Why, why is that an open attack? The spirits dance. Huh? They had two stacks? Why did they use that right away? Very confusing. I need them to block with this so we can uh, disintegrate, right? Minus 28. You can do better than that. I, I can't. I want to Lubella, but I can't because I, I don't know what answers they could run. And I really need to disintegrate I their 9 9. Game of hide and burn. I, I'm scared to develop because if they have another Sombers on Telsey, I have no way to win. So if I. Okay. I thought any stuns. No, she leveled on the stack. So th these aren't stunned. These are this is her level one ability. I have to do this or I die. Do, do they run Bastion? I don't know, man. I got yeah. I mean, Yumi is pretty clever in his deck. I'll be honest. I just want to kill this three one and have a big blocker. Uh, this this three one like with Overwhelm, I think that's the only thing that can really kill us. If they decide to develop next turn, we have the stuns. So. I'm just trying to be able to deal with whatever they throw at us. It's a pretty good card too. Okay, so they can't like randomly get an elusive off of this or something. That's a top deck right there. That all you got? Oh my god, that I, man, I I I can't play around Thor decks running interaction, man. That is too wild. What? Dude, they, they had so many stacks. I just never used them. I'm not gonna be at my abode. I'm not. It's, it's a it's a pro player, man. Is that an Aragorn? Win? No, it's just a regular win with Aragorn Aragorn win backup. I'm like, oh, Poros, no interaction. They're just running Poros and snacks. And then boom, Sunburst. <laughs> Harsh. Oh my god, the mirror, but they have more mastery points. Is that auto lose? Tentacles by Gem is not that good, but I am int it. What do you mean it's not that good? It's sick, man. Now, I'm kind of down to just go triple one drop against another aggro deck. Tippers. Boomer Hothic, Insulux songs were the best. Okay. I can't I can't Let's deny that I have why doesn't this have barrier like in Paddle Champions? I can't deny that I've listened to some of them. But overall, eh. I showed metalheads I know redemption by Pentacle and they liked it. Ah, man, that's that's true approval, man. God damn. 
Old one's not. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I mean, I'm a, I'm a league boomer too. I know which one you're talking about. Maybe watch a paranoia music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just watched it. It was okay. It was alright. I feel like that's just like the general consensus. It's like, yeah, that's fine. But like, okay, don't get me wrong. The fact that they're doing something like this is kind of sick, you know? The, the fact that they're even doing stuff like this at all is pretty insane. Bring the spirits! I've got us covered. Ready. Mm, all right, you know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna play my stuff my and see if we can beat him that way. If we draw another one drop, that's good. If not... Are you watching world games so far? I am, yeah. Okay. I'm trying to follow it as much fun. as I can. I really like it. I, I, I gotta say, so I, I absolutely hate playing against Cassante in game, but I, I gotta just be honest and say that uh, Cassante is a really fun to watch in worlds. Uh, watching Cassante just pop off is really entertaining, but playing against the league is the worst. I mean, he got nerfed and he's terrible now and stuff, but yeah. Uh, Cassante, yeah, that's the one. So I, I like it when people pick Cassante because it's just entertaining. Um, I've seen Ziggs be banned a couple of times, or once I think actually, and picked once. I love Ziggs. You see that? Dude, the Bard was insane, man. That was like the best Bard play I've ever seen in my life. What the hell? Star Guardian here. So close to a one year, eh? Quadrillion, thank you for the 11 months. One more. What about me, bro? Yeah, honestly, Lazarus, yours might be better. I, I don't know why they didn't put you up on the world stage. Kind of a misplay by them. Explosive pride. All right, they have more one drops. We lost GG. You've got a weird eye, Mr. Jin. The better to aim with, my dear. <laughs> we got toppers. With this fire, there's shivers! GG, they drew Jin better. Actually, true, man. This will shake him. Not cool. So, Annie can block here. We can block here. I have prepared something good. Annie gets stunned. Annie gets stunned. What's your favorite Amina? Is there is there any value in clearing more of their stuff? Moving because we side. have stuns? It probably is, right? I think this is worth it because we have stuns. This comes in the moment before I fire. The you at, at one. So Pirate can hit this and this. I will give them a show to remember. They could have a uh, fervor, I guess. I am frightened, but I am ready. Embrace it. Your adoring public awaits. Oh, that's an entire hand that I have forced on the front. It's Mr. Kaido! Oh, I didn't have to play that, actually. Jin level? It's no. Kythera. Hey, yeah, we deal one damage hey, here. We have Tibbers. I'm going for a walk. A couple of stuns. Oh. We have one card. We have two, plus Tibbers. The curtain rises. I mean, this can't be a good attack for them. Beautiful, is it not? Depends on what this is. If it's another stun, I don't even think it matters that much. I just want a big walker here. It's pretty funny that we're like Remember so close to winning objectives. when we're clearly like playing a super combo heavy version. Okay, that's all their that's all their cards. Does Buck do it? 
buck is a three damage from Annie. What is this thing? There is art here. That's, uh, that's a Waiting. Kind of thing. They have no fearsome blocker. Well, they just stunned it anyway. I knew you'd find your mark eventually. Grab it. I bring music and war. That's unfortunate, man. If they didn't have that, I mean, I think we lose next turn now. No, we're still alive. First time to go. It's almost time. Lucas Lethal? It, it's not, right? I don't, know. I don't think it is. Route Three down. <laughs> what is this game? Okay, Jin deals four. Um, it depends on what they top deck, I guess. Yeah, but I mean, we're dead to top deck her, but so are they. Rip. Places, people. I will give them a show to remember. Yeah, watch them get it, dude. You're kidding. Prepare they top deck and wait to stop lethal, and then they top deck lethal. They had no fearsome blocker, so the pyramid would have killed them, or the the tippers would have killed them. No one puts out my fires. Them. I don't think you've seen a lot of music videos, and I mean, when I was a kid, I have, but it would just be like you know. People singing and dancing in like a it, it was more like, you know, having like this really exotic environment or something that people would be dancing and singing in, but it would still be focused on the actual singing. It's just action. And I, I mean, you know, fair point. I, I I shouldn't be criticizing anything. I don't I don't know anything about music or music related things, so um, you know, if people like it, yeah, good for you. There was a little fella asking for me. Run away by I prefer the Sunny song. I mean, yeah, just wait until I uh, I get like a video clip like that produced for it, man. You're gonna love it even more. Songs in my days when I started League was Warriors. Oh, Warriors was insane, man. I love Warriors. It was so wild that they were doing that to me. Put on me mask, secure me tail, start the day. That's good. Should I attack with Prefect? It's kind of open to Bridal still. Warriors was 2014, right? I know, yeah, it was 2014, I'm pretty sure. Maybe 2015? I think 14. Bridal still does exist though? No, it, it does, it does. I'm not attacking with a 4 3 into a Sky Splitter. I'll grow the girl a bit bigger. Warriors more like Collapness. That's true, that's actually true. That's very true. Yeah. People, people will seem to really dislike Ignite, generally, which is the one that came after it, I believe. That was probably my favorite, surprisingly. Oh, if mushrooms could talk. I really like Ignite, man. I can't even really explain why. I have my orders. Really? Yeah, I loved it, man. I thought the clip for that they was insane. Grow up so fast. <laughs> Ignite wasn't bad. Was um, okay. I'll, I I guess as a song, I liked it more, just as a song over like it being something made for me. I, I thought the the song. I just really liked the song. It was something I would like listening to. For me, the spirits dance. Observe and learn. You can do better than that. You can do better than that. I uh, I could have played Annie. Four, five. Finding details is my duty. You're giving me a tome? Come on, that all you got? Like it in Night Over Warriors is too hot of a day. Hey man, it's it's my it's my personal taste. Okay, it is what it is, dude. 
What do you want me to say? Bro, I, aren't they just dead? What are they? What are they waiting for here? Dippers, do you want to go play? All right, well here we go. Uh, Come on. Good luck, I guess. <laughs> Where there's fire, there's Dippers. I mean, there's no way to defend against that. This is what three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen. That's fourteen damage on stacks. All right. Well. Uh, that's 13 damage gone, but I still think that with that double freeze, they're gonna have a really tough time defending against this. We wanted you to join the high by to say ignite, but yeah, mission failed. Try again, dude. Bucks. I like ignite. I, 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 it's easily the world song I listen to by far the most. They, <laughs> brittle steel isn't real, by the way. It's okay to be wrong. Yeah, good thing I'm always right then, huh? Beg your pardon? <laughs> nah, man. Ignite was sick. I love Ignite. Uh, okay, okay. R real talk, though. The song I listened to the most from anything that League released was uh, was Lightbringer from the Cartus Band from Pentakill. Oh, did you? Lightbringer, by far my favorite. Oh, did you? <laughs> Okay, they just let us play Bubble Boot. I am the library, dude. I played so much Cartus back then, too. I bought the Pentakill Cartus skin because when he ults, he would say, I am the Lightbringer. And I love that. I love that. He was my favorite champion for a good while because of that. It was so sick, dude. So good. Thinking outside the box, Zillion Victor, Time Bomb Printer, one, two, pop. Meta shifter, not a quitter, fighting for LPP.